first thing you should come in your mind that if you've got a lump, if needs to be removed, get it removed. You know the very common term used is lumpectomy. Though we use it now, it is a wide excision of the lump. Because, but you will find every time a lumpectomy, whether you should go for lumpectomy or not. If you have a lump which is growing in size, which is sizable, which is palpable, and then in that case, if you have any strong family history of cancer, there is no harm in removing a breast lump. Because the next question is, is this lump is going to be malignant, become malignant? So let me tell you again that it is not necessary that all breast, benign breast tumor will become malignant. But what we see that number of benign tumor turning into malignancy is increasing now. So a patient is having 20 years of lump and now it has become a malignant. This kind of scenario we are seeing very often nowadays. So anybody who is having lump which is palpable, growing in size, removing lump, it is not going to affect your breast size, shape or any if you have any problem like tomorrow if you want to lactation, breastfeeding, nothing is going to happen. It is actually sometimes the scar is also not seen. So it it is absolutely safe if you have a lump go ahead with the surgery and nowadays we don't do FNSC that is fine needle aspiration if there is a suspected lump in that case we go for um, true cut biopsy but not uh, every cases we don't do FNSC most of the cases if you've got a good radiologist virus 2 virus 3 in these cases we go for wide excision if required we can go for a frozen section or a true cut biopsy Nowadays for the breast tumor, FNSC is not advised and uh, anybody I would like to convey this message, whenever you are getting this ultrasonography or mammography, please go to a proper center like in Manipal, we have got an exclusive breast department when very expert uh, radiologists are reporting the breast uh, tumors and uh, there is a very thin line you know between virus 4, 3, 4 or 3 and most of the time you will find that you know virus I am telling you something is just a way of uh, reporting the breast tumor. So if virus 1 is there, 0 is there, it is inconclusive, 1 is there, that is normal, 2 is there benign, 3 is most likely benign and 4 it can be malignant. So not necessary it is malignant. But now it is what we see that most of the centers are reporting it 4A even in very benign diseases which are just virus 2. So whenever you are getting that radiology, this ultrasound or mammography, you should go to a very specialized department or very specialized hospital when the reporting is done well uh, properly because most of the places they are writing 4A and there is doing biopsies in these cases. So almost many benign breast diseases are getting biopsies which is radiologically they do not require any biopsy. So whenever you are going and that actually causes a lot of trauma even if it turns out to be benign but the this negative biopsies create a lot of mental trauma. So that is what most important thing would I like to say that in Manipal Mukundapur, we have got exclusive breast department and very efficient radiologist and pathologist are there. So this is a multidisciplinary department when everybody puts their mind and whenever when we are going to diagnosis any tumor, radiology department has to be very talented or this very uh, efficient in diagnosis. So we can avoid lot of benign biopsies in these patients.